two of them, the one going to get Agnes Bain is going to become more important in the upcoming book. Yes. I think that you get to know a lot more about him, especially since he's the crossover. That's true. Okay, um, I would say yes, we get to know a lot more about Magnus, especially because, um, I mean, probably you haven't read these yet, but the he is the crossover character between the um, the Cite de Tenebris books, the, the Mortal Instruments, and the prequels, the Infernal Voices. He's in both series, and so we learn a lot more about his past, and then um, that is going to be important to his future in the uh, Mortal Instruments books, especially his his future with Alec, and we're going to learn uh, more about um, you know his childhood and more about his father and. Uh, and, uh, and and just, you know, um, a lot more about Magnus in general, so he definitely becomes uh, more important. Donc, euh, je dirais oui, effectivement, oui. Euh, c'est vrai que c'est un personnage clé parce que, euh, en, puisque ça fait un peu les liaisons entre euh, les deux, les deux euh, euh, groupes de livres, entre euh, la Cité des Ténèbres et les, euh, les livres de euh, Infernal Mechanism. C'est un mécanisme infernal, je pense que c'est un mec, mais ce n'est pas encore traduit. Merci. Euh, et dans le nouveau livre que vous n'avez pas encore lu, c'était on apprend beaucoup de choses sur son passé et ça informe beaucoup son avenir aussi. On voit ce qu'il devient. On apprend énormément de choses sur son père, sur son enfance. Donc oui, il devient en quelque sorte un personnage plus important.